Yeah. You. Yeah, I think that's my thing. Talking to your mic. Gotta get your mic. Okay, you got your mic. Your mouth talking yours. Asegúrate. Yo. Yeah, asegúrate que está al frente de la boca de él para cuando él esté hablando con otro normal. Yo. Trucho en la avenida. Y tú me oyes mi negro. Al Scur TV. ¡Suéltalo, Joaquín! Oh shit, I forgot. Can you hear me? Yeah. Check your cup now. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, you're good. Estamos ready, estamos todos ready. Estamos en la avenida, estamos truchos en la avenida. Ay, voy, voy con intro. Dense este te quiero, tu cuatro, dale. Damas y caballeros. Niños y niñas. Vamos a darle de nuevo. Vamos a darle de nuevo, sí, pero no te veo juntas. Damas y caballeros, niños y niñas, llévenos a la más candida más potente que hay en el mundo. ¿Qué es lo que tú dices? ¡Podcast! ¡Aplausos, aplauso, por favor! Oh, we here with the, with the people from Cuatro Music. Tenemos que al muchacho Cuatro. Cuatro en la house. Ya está, ya está. Cuatro music en la cabina. Cuatro está aquí en la casa. We got Mel in the house. What up, Mel? Mel, 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 Cisco in the building. Mel, Cisco. Mel, Cisco. That's that. That's your artist name, Mel, Cisco. Yes, right? sir. Mel, Cisco. All right, all right. Cuatro music. Cuatro said he ready for the smoke. That's what he said. At the school of TV. I don't. I don't know what the fuck he's talking about, but I'm about to. I'm about to. I'm about to ask some shit. We gotta speak English because Mel don't speak Spanish. No, no, we speak both. Okay, we speak Spanish. We'll dabble into Spanish. Mel's gonna be like, you know, you got. You have to like find the key words. And connect the dots. And connect the dots. Context clues. I got you. Context clues. Right. Got you. Got you. Spanish. 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 Got you. Got you. Cuatro. Tú me dices está está ready para el fuego. Fuego. Suerte. Aquí en New Jersey. Oh, perdón, no, 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 no dije que aquí estamos con, con mi co-host, mi hermano del alma, mi compañero Jorge Alaire. ¿Cómo se encuentran, caballeros? Yo soy Cristín Flow. No se olviden suscribirse, no se olviden darle like, no se olviden compartir, esto es, ¿qué es lo que tú dices? Oh, okay. No se olviden que aquí es que tienen que dejar los comentarios. <risa> Oye, aquí. Ahí. Bueno. Eh, cuatro. Habla. Yeah. De aquí, de, de Newark. No voy a hablar de New Jersey porque hay muchos tigres aquí en okay, New Jersey. Okay. De Newark. ¿Quiénes son los tigres más duros rapeando por aquí? ¿Rapeando? ¿En qué eh, sentido? Eh? Rapeando, en música. ¿Quiénes son los duros? Hay mucha gente. Está Taiko. Está Ajá. Está Manuel. Ajá. Está Lilo. Ajá. Tú sabes, está Gillo que está por ahí. Gillo, ajá. Hay mucha gente. Pero... ¿Y, ¿Y quiénes son los que no sirven? A ver, dame, dame. Ay, dame ay, luz. Ay, ay, ay. Who, who, who is the nigga that is trash over here rapping? Slim bars. Who trash? Pero que, ¿cómo te puedo decir? Nah, you, you, que, you said you wanted to smoke. I want to know the information. You probably know, you, you probably know everybody. I don't, I don't know everybody. No, no, no. Everybody no, 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 that you mentioned right now, Gillo, Taiko, Luminati, no, Mateo. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? Manuelo. All them my niggas. I know they are. Who trash? Sí. Who Se la prendo. Negro, you know who trash? I'm trying to think. Well, those, are the, those are the only niggas I know. Right, those are the niggas that I know. In Newark, yeah. No, but I'm much. Hey, much. Hey, listen, listen, listen. listen. It's, it's, El Manual. El Manual. Es cual otro. El que anda con el Manual también. I don't know his name. I don't know his name. Chash. No sé. Who trash? There's no competition. That's that's the word. No competition. There's no comp for 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 the people that I mentioned. No competition. Not for people you mentioned. I'm just saying. There's no comp. It's like once I once I really hop on and they see what's going on. Mega boss. Oh, Mel going crazy. Wait, no, nah, no, nah, you can't just stop Mel saying. Say, say that one more no, time. No, I, I don't understand what you're saying, bro. Listen, listen. I, I'm not hearing you, bro. Here, here come. I wanna. I wanna, wanna directly, directly, I wanna directly say someone is trash. You know. Okay. Okay. I would just say that. Nobody could compete with you. Exactly. 
Okay. Once I once I really start. So all you motherfuckers that think you can make music, bro. Mel saying y'all niggas is trash, bro. You know what I'm saying? He hey. literally said that shit because y'all can't compete with him. That's all I'm saying. Me lo pasa. Me lo pasa. Ah, da, habla. Todo el mundo tiene su línea. Todo el mundo sabe. Ya lo están la ligagen aquí. Entonces no me digan que van a venir con fuego. Si van a... No, pero que la vamos a aprender. Pero que no vamos a aprender tan rápido. No, no yo, 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 comienzo, yo comienzo prendido. ¿Qué Cuando pasa? como un toro acelerado. No, eh. Normal. Así, a fuego. Fuego puro. Fuego. ¿Cuáles son, ¿cuál son, cuál son la, la, los planes para 4 Music? ¿Cuáles son los planes para 4 Music? 4, da, da, dame, Mira, dame luz. 4 eh, Music, tú sabes. Para que no se, lo que no saben, somos un grupo, una compañía aquí mismo en New York que estamos divididos en dos diferentes categorías, que es inglés y español. Eso es el dos mercado. Tú sabes, okay. Ben y Cisco, aquí artista sí. americano, bien duro. Eh, nadie lo conoce por ahora, pero llévense de mí, mira. Feo. Feo. Eh, sí. Para el movimiento. Ok. Y me he prendido. Okay, Mel. When it comes to your music, right? When yes, it comes sir. To, to to what you do, who were the niggas that like inspired you? Like the artists that you were know, like, oh yeah, this nigga. Like I, I hear this nigga. And I I think I could do that. I think that gravitates to what I could do. Okay, so me growing up, you know, what my life been. I gravitated towards. I would say Jay Z. Jay Z, because he was a person that beat the odds, you know, of many things. Yeah. And I feel like once I rap or if I like spit in front of somebody, it's always a life changing situation for me. They okay. always remember me from what I say. Okay. So that's what you know. So you say Jay? Okay. Okay. Which J- Which Jay do you like more? Beginning J, mm. mid tier J, oh, like old the, sc- old head J. Yeah, the the, the it's drop, three J's. Uh, drop knowledge to these niggas. Type J. There's nineties J, two thousand J, mm. and then I am a father of three kids J. <laughs> we'll go four J. Four I will go for the nineties. Nineties J. Yeah. Hard knock life J. Yeah. Hey tonight. Because that's when he really. That's when he was really. He was hungry he, for it. He, yeah, he was. Yeah. He was trying to. He was trying to prove that he wasn't a, an original person mm. that's just trying to grab you know <coughs> okay so <sighs> so you're saying 90s Jay, but what, what can you take out of 2020 j i mean it's 2010s to 2020 j that 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 those 10 years of j i mean it, it's cool you know for the he said it's cool. It's, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is cool. cool for the development of the youth or the his surroundings. No, I'm talking about as a rapper, Jay. I, what, yeah. what what's the what's the the difference? Why don't you like this Jay as much as you liked that Jay? Well, when it comes to bars. Okay. It, okay. I only picked the '90s Jay because that's what inspired me to. Okay. You know, continue on what I'm doing. But as far as this Jay, it's like <clears throat> once he actually meets me, or here's how I, here how I rap, may influence him or to change to think differently about what's coming or the upcoming rappers. Okay, I don't. You think Jay thinks a certain way about the upcoming rappers? Uh, I mean, you don't give him. You don't give him the respect. I guess. No, no, no I give him the respect. Yes. Now I'm talking about Jay himself to the new rappers. Like, you know how old heads are like, oh, y'all niggas don't really rap no more. Yeah, it's like, I feel like not enough people are impressing him enough for him to want to do be the 90s Jay anymore. Mm. Huh? Think about that, nigga. What you think about that? Well, I think I think that's a valid point, right? I think there's a, there's a difference between having a certain culture that drives you to do a certain type of lane, right? Yeah. And when you don't, and when you don't have the the appreciation for the people who are doing the culture right now, yeah. or not necessarily appreciation, but just maybe just don't connect with what's being spoken about or what's being um, portrayed. Guess, portrayed. Said. You know, mm-hmm. you might not connect with it, but also I think that you have to think about, you know, twenty uh, something year old Jay and thirty year old Jay and, and fifty four, year old you know, Jay, fifty year old Jay. You're in your different mindset, so you're therefore, different, different therefore, people. you 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 know you speak about different things, you rap about different things. Right, so I think that you know, I think that also you have to when you think about a an artist, 
you know, you have to also understand, you know, what point of their life they are and, you know, what are they going to speak about? Because think about it, you know, what what's what's a 20 year old rapping about, you know, you know, living, living, a uh, a. Uh, uh, Living and investing, and you know, talking about family Kids goals and, and stuff. You know what I mean? Okay. Like it does. It, it, it doesn't connect the same way when someone who's in is currently living that life. So, like, like you said before, right? You know, we know Jay Z has gone through a transition from you know from the streets, you know, to the businessman that he is today, yeah. right? What Jay was talking about when he was in the streets pertained to the streets, right? Now he's talking about um, you know. I'm a grown man with a family, you know, that I got goals, I got to worry about my future, I got to, you know, protect lives, you yeah. know what I mean? Like, it's a it's a the different... future of my kids, I know how it was when I was younger, I don't want my kids to go through shit. Exactly, so you speak things. about different things. So I think that's the thing with artists, right, that, you know, with age, I think sometimes we... We think differently. We fall in love with certain um, age groups that they have, right? Yeah, yeah, um, because we pertain, you know, we relate to that, right? But, you know, once they exit that, that lifestyle or that age group you know mm. sometimes we feel like oh they change they're not the same well they have changed right they aren't the same yeah. right mm. they speak about different things and i think every artist somewhere down the line will go through something similar to that cuatro tú tú eres un manager ahora eres un ceo verdad un tigre que lo que está behind the scene pero pero hace un año atrás un año yo creo fue un año atrás tú te metiste un estudio y hiciste dos canciones. <risa> tú, tú eras rapero. No. En los tiempos no, de antes. No, 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 no. Tú no eras no rapero. rapero. No eras rapero en los tiempos de antes. ¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasa? No es rapero. Lo que pasa es que yo soy una persona que me gusta la música. Ajá. Hace, yo le, yo le puedo decir. De, no me dé labia, por favor. No, no, te voy a dar labia. Okay, yo okay. te puedo decir, hace como tres años. No me, no me suavice hoy. No, hace tres años atrás <risa> yo no pensaba en la música, en verdad. Yo no pensaba en hacer música. La música era mi terapia para mí, personalmente. Yo no me lo oía ya. Sí, ya. Flo, flo de escucha. Yo pasé saco de trabajo. Te estoy diciendo, me mudé de tal, saco de vaina. Y una persona me dijo a mí que lo, my gift is on something that I do every day. Uh -huh. Tú sabes, yo dije, mierda, déjame pasar eso. Déjame salir de la música. Yep. No, verdad. La vaina de la música es que yo soy una persona que le gusta crear mucha idea. Tú sabes, yo creo idea. Uh -huh. Tú sabes, yo no soy la persona que la rapea así, te la puede escribir. Te puedo escribir algo ahí, pero me gustaría como trabajar con la persona ahí al lado. Tú no, quieres, tú no quieres ser estrella, tú lo que te, quieres, no, quieres estar involucrado. No, no, exacto. Ah, ya, ya, plug, ya. Plug. La, este, la extension. Yo la, te, la paleta. La, la extensión. <risa> <risa> yo, soy, yo soy la extensión, hoy. Yo soy la paleta, ahí. Tú me ponías ahí, yo con el a todo el mundo. Yo soy un, tú eres un plug, tú, eres, tú tienes dos plugs y yo tengo cuatro. Eso es ah, lo que sí, tú quieres decir. Que... Tú eres la extensión. Exactly. Cuatro, cuatro de, insten de extension. Yeah, hey, exactly. you know, you know, an extension cord has four things. Claro, you know? Is it four? Yeah, yeah. Mo no, there's more that have there's more. There's more than one that have more, pero la normality. Cada paleta tiene como cuatro o cinco. Sí. Así estamos todos conectados. Cuatro de extensión que tiene que llamarte. Yeah. Eso es lo que tiene que decir tu, tu Instagram. Cuatro de extensión. Pero esa es la cosa. Que <laughs> mira lo que pasa. Nadie lo sabe, pero mucha gente lo sabe. Solo, tú solamente creces con la gente que tiene alrededor. Si la gente, si tú estás solo en una ciudad, sí tú lo puedes hacer, pero no vayas muy lejos. Tú sabes, tú siempre tienes que tener otra persona atrás que te caiga atrás. How we go, how we go from cuatro trying to go crazy on niggas to, 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 to cuatro de experiencia, to cuatro motivation, fucking, es que tengo, es que the tengo, preacher, nigga, es, fuck is you talking? Es que tengo Where we at, nigga? Es que, cuatro we motivations, cuatro motivations. We, we, we are in school, <laughs> we in a speech in school. What's it called? What's it called? Aprende, porque es que tú, tú me dijiste a mí que le iba a aprender. Te dije cuatro, vamos a hacer un poco. Te voy a involucrar en un poco porque está aquí. Olvídate del que te está llamando. Dile que, dije yo, dile que dije yo que no, coge, que no cogemos el teléfono esta hora. Y cuatro KMG talking to God and shit. Let's go with this nigga, man. Mira lo que pasa. Te la voy a aprender. Te la voy a aprender ahora. Go ahead. Te la voy a aprender. Yo no quiero hacer nada malo. Yo no quiero hacer nada malo. Yo quiero hacer algo bueno. Ay, Dios mío. Eso es viene, viene cuatro. ¿Tú sabes por qué? Hace, te voy a decir, te lo voy a decir, un diciembre. ¿Un diciembre atrás? Un diciembre atrás. Uno solo, son el 2021. Sí, ¿El que pasó? El que pasó. A una de mi artista. Ajá. Te voy a decir, YIYO. A una de mi artista. Shout out to you. Pusieron un comentario. ¿Quién puso un comentario? No, si va a hablar, habla claro. Digo yo, negro, dime tú. Si va a hablar, habla claro. El comunicador, ah, el comunicador de Jersey. ¿Quién es? Eh, eh. ¿Quién no sabe? Fulson. 
Oh, Fulton Klein. Fulton Klein. No me gustó lo que hizo. ¿Qué no hizo? Me gustó lo que, lo, ¿Qué hizo? Lo que ¿Qué hizo, hizo Fulton? ¿Qué hizo? Puso un comentario en diciembre que se iba a ganar el que prenda su comentario, el que prenda su comentario. Iba a ganar una entrevista con él gratis, lo que sea. Pero ¿Él sabe. cobra por entrevista? Sí. Te voy a decir que sí. Yo no sabía. No, pero ya sabe. Oh, shit. Yo no sabía wow. esa vaina. Pero no te, vamos a cobrar nosotros. Porque... Yo voy a comenzar, yo voy a comenzar sí, a cobrar por entrevista. Ya lo sabe, ya habló. No me gustó lo que hizo. Se la ganó Gillo, se la aprendimos en el comentario, se dijo Ajá. que sí, y lo que dijo, oh, yo voy a esperar que haya más contenido. No se hace. So, se prometió, no se, hace. se prometió una entrevista por después comentario. de prender por comentario. Se Dije, porque los la comentarios. pregunta es la siguiente, la pregunta es la siguiente, porque sí. como yo no sé, quiero saber, ¿no? ¿Verdad? Eh, se dijo que Gillo fue el que ganó. Sí. Se dijo, se anunció, sí. Gillo. Gillo es el ganador. Sí. Entonces, cuando iba a suceder la entrevista, dijo, no, vamos a aguantar la entrevista porque no hay suficientemente contenido. Sí. Contenido de Gillo. Sí. Contenido de Gillo. De cuando Ya él tenía el video de... Sí. Me llama el chef. Estaba fuera. Ok. That was perfect. Ahí mismo. No se va a hablar más. Ahora, yo, yo como sí. entrevistador, defendiendo el entrevistador aquí, no, ¿verdad? Yo creo que a veces... Devil's Advocate. Yeah, Devil's Advocate aquí. Yo creo que a veces hay artistas que quieren la entrevista... Quieren eh, hacer el contenido, pero no tienen de qué hablar. Right? There's not enough experience in the game for you to be able to sit down and have an interview. También. So, ¿tú crees que puede ser que eso sea algo por lo cual él dijo, no, ahora, ahora, no, ahora no. no? Puede ser, ¿qué me importa a mí? Niggas, I'll go fuck. I'll go fuck. Niggas said, I want my fucking interview. I want my interview. I want, aunque sea dos minutos. Yeah, I want my interview and I want it now. Yo lo quiero. Yo lo quiero. No, no, ya, ya tú estás que ya con él. No quille, no quille, no quille, no quille en verdad. Es como más, yo creo que es como más disappointed, como que mi sí, hermano no haga eso, sí. no lo anuncie. Yeah. Si tú sabes, Exacto. tú me preguntas, güey, si yo tiene tanto, tanto, tanto. No, oye, él ganó, pero vamos a coger otro tigre porque el tigre tiene más vaina y le hacemos la entrevista un chisme para adelante cuando él tenga más vaina y ya. Digo yo. No. Yo no soy entrevistador, yo no soy de entrevista, yo no hago entrevista, yo, yo hablo plepla. No, no, yo, yo entiendo a veces que hay ciertas no. que tú te sientas en y como que no hay de qué hablar. ¿No es verdad? Okay. Eh, pero yo creo también que si tú como entrevistador prometiste que iba a ser una entrevista, tiene que hacerlo. Exacto. <risa> eh, eh, mira, lo que más, mira lo que pasa. Lo que más vale de un hombre es que... La palabra. La palabra Exacto. No si tú no tienes palabra, vete medio ahí. Ya. Yo te quiero. Ya. Y te, te adoro y de y, todo. Y, y muchas gra mucha gracias no, por apoyar a los tigres. Y si, tigre. si mentiste que no trabajo contigo. Que no trabajo contigo. Pero hay que decirte la cosa. Hay que decirle la verdad. No me gusta keep it real, keep it real, keep it real. Hay que decirle la verdad a Fulcho. No me gusta eso. Pues yo he visto los trabajos de Fulcho. Fulcho hace un buen trabajo, en verdad. Él hace un buen trabajo. Ay, me encanta cómo él habla. Oye, yo no sé, ¿tú has visto mi entrevista? Sí, sí, sí. Yo he visto mi entrevista. Oye, él me inspira. Es bacano, Fulcho es bacano, Fulcho es bacano. Es bacano, 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 es Ok, Mel. Vamos, vamos para atrás con Mel. Porque Mel está aquí callado. Él no habla español. <risa> no, no, no. Like, yo, I got no clue what the fuck let's I go, need to talk let's about. Go, let's go back to American speaking. You hear me? Yes. Yo, what's up, man? You speak what up, Mel? English? What up, Mel? Yo. Tell me a story of, of you, like, in a studio or something. Something that you... Oh, no, no, no. This is perfect right here. This is the first time you went to the studio. Uh -huh. How was your experience? Did you... Did you were you nervous? And and what was the song that you that you recorded? Okay, so nigga, speak like a fucking yo. I'm about to beat this nigga up. I swear. Oh, yeah, I'm fighting. 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 I'm I was going to a point in my life where it was like, I'm about to just do what I need to do, and the people around me wouldn't matter. Okay, uh, what, and what, what does do what I have to do mean? What does that entail? As, as far as build myself, like my career. Okay. You know, my music. Uh, and and, and at, at what cost? My own. What do you mean your own? Like, like what were you losing? That, you know, what, or, or what you were you losing? Away for it? Exactly. What were you putting aside to take this path of, you know, I'm just going to pursue my career? Like, are you talking about you were putting, like, relationships no. aside? Were you putting family aside? Like, that's no. what I'm talking about. My focus. Focus. And what were you focused on before? Uh, them. People around me. Instead of focusing on my craft. Okay. So I feel like if I let them go, 
then I can do what I need to do. Mm. Because I was just worried about other people, like worried about other things other than my happiness. Are you are you cool with that? With like you know leaving people behind and you know leaving I mean, you know, well, certain I've, relationships. Uh, I've gotten this far, so <laughs> it's helped me. You know, I've gotten this far. Okay, so you you you've gone into the thing you wanted to do, you're taking that step. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So if you were still putting a lot of interest in those people, you you think you wouldn't take in that step. That's what you that's where you at right now? Yeah. Okay. Focus. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. How many how many songs you got recorded? I got about six songs recorded. Okay. When did you start recording? I'm about to I'm about to roast you right now, nigga. I swear to God. Yeah, <laughs> When do you start recording? <laughs> you said, when did I start writing? When do you start recording? Are these six songs that you have, uh-huh. what's the time period of these six songs? I know you have to pay for studio time and all that shit. It's, it's expensive shit. That's why I don't rap no more. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. I say six songs. Six songs that I that I think is good. No, no, no. I said how many songs you got recorded. I didn't say how many songs you putting out. Because yeah. fucking... Uh-huh. Okay, this is a stupid comparison, but Chris Brown has thousands of songs recorded, right? He ain't putting thousands of songs out, though. You know what yeah, I'm mean? saying? Right. Got the question. Okay. How many songs you got recorded? <laughs> so, about like, if I'm counting it? Yeah. At average. Give me an like, average. That's an estimate. 32. Not be- <coughs> 32. Okay, when did you start recording? At 16. At 16. So, you got, how old are you now? 28. 28, 16, what's the math, nigga? That's eight. Eight years? Yes. 16 songs in eight Wait, years. Wait, no, so how old are you right now? 28. 28, you started when you were 16? My bad, that's 12. 12, 12 years. Wrong math. So, so <laughs> what do you say? How many I songs you said? How many songs you said? 30 something? 30 something in 12 years. So, how many songs is that? You're, you're looking at maybe a two possibly song, two, two something. Two to three songs two a, a, year. a year? Yeah. And when did you cut off everybody to do the songs? Or not cut off, like put them aside and focus more? It music. was like a, it was like a split time period where I just went MIA. Okay, when was that? When you know what year was that? Two years, three years ago, four years ago. It's like five years ago. Five years ago. Okay. The, the real question is, how many songs have you made from after, that time from that five years to now? To now? Like ten. Like ten. Ten of the out of the thirty. Okay, so when, when I'm seeing in your math, right? Is that you were making more music when you had those people around than what you did from those five years, no? Mm, ten out of thirty. Uh, ten out of thirty, but in you have to think years. about yeah, but you have to think about that he just in the last five years made ten and he's yeah, been there yeah, for yeah. twelve. Twelve gets twenty, twenty divided by twelve is looking at a one in point something. Five, no, he's he's producing more now. He's producing more now. Because in five, because in five, shit. He, yeah, because in five he did so ten. I'm so he's, I'm he's just exactly, now. so exactly at a two songs per I year. Before he was at like a one point something. Yo, they hit God with some mathematics. I was about to, I was about to roast, I was about to roast my man. Okay, and this is, you know, he's my man. So, so here's my here's here's my thing with this uh with people creating, right? I think that especially when you're starting, um, you need to create uh quantity. Constant right. creation, constant yeah. creation, and, it, and I'm not and I'm not saying that you publish every single one that you create, yeah. right? But the thing is, work on the craft as much as you can, right? Because the thing is, the reality is, is that even if it's a bad song, you might learn a lesson within that bad song, yeah. right? It might, it might be a bad song, but the hook probably good, so you probably take that hook, make another different song with different verses, different or or, or even in just or even just in your craft, right? Because like like there's people who like first gotta hear. Which I always recommend, right? They always they, they have to hear a beat to then write, right? There's mm-hmm. people who write before they mm-hmm. you hear, hear a beat. You know what I mean? There's 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 people who don't necessarily they just need to be in a certain like mood, mood and they just to, write some shit to write something, right? So I think you know learning that about yourself helps you yeah. in your craft, and that's why I always say like you do the quantity, right? Do the quantity. I'm not telling you to put out the quantity, right? Just yeah. create, but, yeah. but just create, 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 because then after a while, and then this is another thing in in the music means a lot of people think that they have to be the artist. You know what I mean? And there's so many other ways for you to make money. Exactly. Right? Where stop. So, like, there's... I, I, I know one of my boys who he's an artist, and to be honest, he's put his artist career in the back 
And all he does is he writes music for people. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? And most of his royalties that he gets, mm-hmm. he gets it because, you know, he pitches it to Sony. He pitches it to Fulani Tal, mm-hmm. right? Okay. And, you know, and that comes along, you know, that comes along, obviously, with your experiences and knowledge mm-hmm. and making yeah. the connections, yeah. right? But the thing is that you start seeing different paths in the music business, and it allows you to now decide, okay, you know what? I might make a lot of music, right, that I love, mm-hmm. but I'm not profiting as much as I should be, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know what? You know, I might just put this to a side for a little bit. I'm not saying give up on it, right? Yeah. Well, I'm saying mm-hmm. just put it up and then put to a point where you have such a residual income coming in from songs that you've already sold. Okay. Then you're like, okay, I have one. I got enough. Um, I have enough revenue that I can now be and like, I, I get, cool. I, I can invest like, this yeah. into one of my projects. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You okay. know? That's a fact. That's a fact right there. Okay. That's a fact. Here come, here come negative talking and philosophy too. I'm the only nigga that be. I'm the only nigga that be joking up in this bitch, like, <laughs> like dead ass, man. Like, well, I mean, I mean, I, 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 I should be writing a song soon, so you know, if you excuse me, <laughs> excuse me, <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Bitch, this nigga got donut bars, nigga. He got donut bars. I'm about to, I'm about to write, I'm about to write, um, about to write, um the next dembo that's gonna be um, international. Que lo hagan toki, fried chicken. Que lo hagan toki, fried chicken. Que lo hagan toki, fried chicken. Fried chicken, fried chicken. Fried chicken, fried chicken. I'm a dembo set of what I done both saw. What are you talking about, man? Come on, man. Right there, nigga. Y'all niggas think, nigga. Come on, son. Que lo que, come on, man. We got them both after them both. Oh, yeah, cuatro, de, de, cuatro, de, de, de un hombre casado. No. Ok. Casado una sola persona, mi hija. Ey, ey, ey. Está bien. Entonces, yo, la hija mía bacana también. Shout out, shout out to everybody that has a daughter or son. Shout yeah, out. shout out to the parents. Shout out to the parents. Shout, shout out to the parents. Shout out to the parents. Mel, you, you got a girl? Yes, sir. All right, we can't talk thotties with you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have a girl too. I'm, I'm not talking thotties either. But this nigga right here, right? You're the thought. you the thought in the building. This nigga's no, the, no, this no, nigga's no. the only thought in here. No, okay? no, no. Okay. No, no, no. You're the only thought. You're the only thought. You're the only thought. Cuatro. Dime, háblame. ¿En cuántos días tú te metes al día? Bien. Ajá. Al día. Al día. Todos los días. Pero cuánto, cuánto al día? Son pares, depende. Tú sabes. It, is is there DM etiquette? Is there DM etiquette? That's, 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 that's a good question. That's a great question. Is there DM etiquette? No, me lo pasa. Es de cada día. Ajá, ajá. Ya viene, ya viene. Las mujeres no están en, hey, how you doing? No están en eso. ¿Qué es lo que están? Ahora, tira la yigulai. ¿Cómo la yigulai? Explícame la yigulai. El punto G. ¿Cuál es el punto G? De una vez. ¿Cuál es de una vez? ¿Cómo me gusta? Ajá. Corazón rojo contigo. Y ya. Corazón rojo contigo. Y ya. Does that work? ¿Cuántas veces? ¿Cuántas veces? ¿Cuántas veces? Es hombre casado, ya ese hombre. Es hombre casado, es hombre retirado ya de mi, de 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 mi tiempo. Ningún picabú del diablo. No. We, we married men back no, here. No, You're what, the only what, thought here, bro. What, what I'm asking is, you know, like, you know, like, does, you know, what's, what's, what would you say is the proper way to uh, slide into a girl's DM? You know, Mel, ah, uh, nah, nah, this is the question right here. No, better thing, because negros, negros, negros asking this question. Mel, how, how long have you been with your girl? Ten years. Ten years. Shout out to shout out to Mrs. Mel. You know what I'm saying? When you got with your girl ten years ago, Instagram was a thing. Okay, did you hit her in, up in the DMs or you guys knew each other and then got together? You guys knew each other. Damn, I was about to be. Yeah, like, I wanted. What I wanted was the, what was the DM game? What was the DM game? <laughs> and I was saying, you did hit her up on uh, in no, text message high, though. It was high school. Yeah, yeah, but you had a t- you had her phone number. You ha- you had to play, kick some game. We was in the same Spanish class. Spanish, oh, class. Spanish class. This nigga, this nigga, t- you passed that Spanish class? Of course. What school you go to? <laughs> what school you went to? Campus, East Orange. East Orange. East Orange. Yeah, them niggas suck over there. <laughs> Cause I don't know how you pass that shit. Listen, we, we spoke Spanish. This nigga was looking at us like, listen, listen. these niggas speaking gibberish. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. No, 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 no. No, en español, en español, en español. He said no, no, no. Ahorita, más tarde, más tarde, más tarde, tell him más tarde, later, later, later. más tarde, más tarde, más tarde. <laughs> yeah, this nigga played. Uh huh. Was basic forgetful shit, cause. <laughs> What's shit. basic forgetful shit? You forgot everything. <laughs> 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 basic forgetful shit. Now, just the Spanish that you guys are talking. Oh no, that's something else. <laughs> 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 
trying to keep up. Yeah, all right, keep all right. Up, so, up, that's all. so up. we grew up in DR. We were kids in DR. 12, 13, 14, 15. You were 15 in DR? 14, right? You uh, 14, I turned 15 here. You turned 15 here, okay. 12, 13, 14, 11, 10. You know, all the, all, the, all the the years that when you were outside, in our years, you were outside. There was no really PlayStation. Nobody got money for that shit. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so you we go, were... You gotta go to the courts. We were outside. We were playing basketball or whatever. And DR, we had the tendency to steal fruits from everybody's house. That's what we <laughs> used to do, right? That, that, that was our adrenaline rush of the week, right? So we used to go take mangoes from niggas' houses. Mango. Right? Mango, sí, limon, everything. Yeah. We used to take everything. The house or the tree? Uh, they go, they, they had the tree right. in the backyard. So yeah. you had to go into their backyard, oh. take their shit, and get the fuck out. Sometimes I believe that's chased. robbery. But yeah, that was, we, were robbery. Definitely, we were definitely taking niggas' that was shit. Scary. That was that? There was no animals? <laughs> no, there's some, 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 some backyards had dogs, but we, oh, we, used, right. to, we, used, to, we used to smack them niggas. Let me get the little white dog out of here. Mel, when you were a kid, yeah, give me a second. Let me finish with my nigga Mel. Yeah, this nigga, bro. Yo, un perro. 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 Yo, when you were a kid, what was the malicious thing, kid thing that you used to do? Like, you know, in the house, your mom tells you don't eat the, and then you like, fuck that, I'm eating the, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, my mom used to be like, don't eat the chocolate to this nigga. Oh, yeah. There's a bar of chocolate like that. We actually got it over there. There's a bar of chocolate like this that my, my mom used to make chocolate. So my mom used to be like, don't eat that shit. So to this nigga Because right? the thing was like That was the chocolate That she would make Like the hot chocolate In the morning For the breakfast yeah. so It's like a chocolate bar it's That you put like in the milk And you let it melt Blah 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 It's so good It's great It's, it's fucking amazing okay. So I would just You know I would, I would wake this up 3 o'clock in the morning And steal it and, You know <laughs> And he would push The chocolates in the box To the front So when mom opened it She would just take the front one And right? it's full So this nigga <laughs> This nigga used to Take that shit My mom <laughs> My mom don't cut this nigga <laughs> Alright, so let me explain you how this oh, would yeah. go down. I right. never did so <laughs> what I would do is, you know, I would I would steal the chocolate bars, right? But then I would notice like if she would open it and the first few are missing, she would notice someone took. So what I would do is I would place one instead of it being flat, I would place the other one up like up down. So it, when you put the rest, it looked like it was a full box of it. Yeah. Right? But my mistake was that the wrappers, I would put it like on the side of my bed inside of the the, the no inside yeah, of the uh, the the bed covers <laughs> inside the bed covers yeah, right yeah so so exactly <laughs> so then so then you know one day she went to like you know make our beds and like you know fix it and she, and she took the bed cover off and when she took the bed cover off it was like a pinata of like just empty just wrappers straight <laughs> wrappers nigga I was oh. yeah I, I got my ass beat though. No, no, nah, nah. yeah. mommy, mommy, yeah. you not bad. My mom almost burnt okay, this nigga okay. hand off. Nah, she almost yeah, burnt it. She turned the stove on, grabbed this nigga hand, put it. Like, my mom was on hey, some other shit. Yeah, she was, was, she was. Well, nah, but that was because I was stealing money. Yeah, but well, it was the that, that's a, it, was the, it was the collective of everything. Yeah, I was, I, was I, 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 yeah, I was. He was, was just stealing everything. I was. I, yeah, I was. A, I wasn't the best. Terrorista. You wasn't the best kid. Wasn't the best kid. <laughs> what, what did you do, man, when you were a kid? What What your mom beat your ass for, <laughs> or your pops, or your auntie, or your grandma? Somebody beat your ass. I know somebody did. Yeah. Well, I was in third grade. Okay, here we go. <laughs> third grade is always the worst. <laughs> no, I don't see it. Third, I skip, fourth. I, I skipped school. You skipped school? You what skipped the, school. What third doing? grade, what the fuck you went? Where, you, where the fuck did you go? Where did you school? Oh, wait, wait, pause. Bring that shit back. Why are you <laughs> skipping third grade? Exactly. Well, You're not doing anything. Exactly. That's the thing. I wasn't doing anything in school, so I didn't want to be there. But it was the influence that I had with me at the time. Oh, your more than that. Yeah. Your little, yeah, your little third know. grade friends with the little third grade skip school delinquents. What are you, eight years old? Something like that. Oh, I will sell it. All right, so my day went. Okay. All right, what you do? What you, tell me all the, everything that happened in the day when you got home, when your mom and your grandma, whoever the fuck, hey, got, found out. When I got home, it was the funny part. Look. Funny what part. You, no, here's the question. What did you do when you skipped school? Yeah. Okay, so... My sisters was walking in front of me. I just turned around. I was like, I'm not going there. So, so your sisters, <laughs> your sisters are older. Uh, one is younger than me, and two are older. Oh, so the the two older one was taking the younger one. The younger one was in. I'm guessing she was like in first grade or some shit. Yeah. All right, so the two older ones taking the younger one. Mel said, <laughs> "Fuck school, I'm out of here." <laughs> okay. I'm dying. So as I turned around, I went down the block and I seen one of my friends. Mm. 
He was like, yo, I'm about to go um, towards the train tracks. I'm like, train tracks? This motherfucker said train tracks. I'm I like, train tracks. Listen, I'm, I'm, like, I'm like, I don't know what he talking about. I'm like, train tracks. Like, Fuck it, because I'm not trying cool. to be around here. Sounds cool. Let's go. <laughs> to the train tracks behind the factory or whatever. And it's an open, like, an open gate, no gate. It's just a railroad right there. Okay. So we're there. And um, he's, like, putting rocks on the railroad tracks. I don't care. Nigga trying to act, uh, oh, fuck make an accident happen or something? I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm clueless of what he's doing. Oh, you're just chilling. I'm just like... You're just like, I'm not going to school. I'll just see this nigga put rocks First, on the road. road. <laughs> First of all, I'm a child, so I'm just so amazed how close I am to railroad. The big ass... <laughs> I'm so like, wow. So you're like, damn, the train really go through it? I'm like, damn, this shit hot still. Is a train here? <laughs> Meanwhile, this nigga got a whole pile of rocks just piling them. She's like, hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm like, first of all, what are you doing? He was like, watch, you'll see. Mind you, I'm like, yo, is this a movie or something? Like, yo, bro, as a kid, I was very animated. So it was like. I you looked, saw everything in front of your face. Exactly. I Good looked away. You didn't do nothing. I looked away. That it was millions of rocks right there. Okay. Good question. Cool. Do you think one of the rocks were smack? Listen, here's the funny. Here's where, here's where it gets real interesting. The train comes. This nigga on some daredevil shit. Waving back and forth, ha, ha, doing all this dumb shit, right? So I'm just looking at him like, hmm, the train is coming. This nigga said, this nigga looked at him like, hmm, the train is coming. All right, keep going. There's, there's a train coming. He's like, I'm, I'm good, I'm good. I'm like, nah, you're not good. Come on, let's go, get off. So he got off, and he was like, no, you want to, you might want to duck for this. I'm like, duck for what? <laughs> He said, you might want to really get out the way. Mind you, he already, he's ducking while I'm talking to him. I'm like, okay. So the train comes. All I hear is ping, 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 ping. Yo, if I didn't duck and look at him and duck, the, the rock that was on that, that flew past my face would have killed me. Oh, shit. Man, almost, how did shit go from funny to like, right. I almost died? <laughs> so that, you know, like, that, that would have been a stupid, yo, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Let me, let me, let me inter, intervene right there. Uh-huh. You know how in, in, in our neighborhoods, right? Yeah. Most of the ki- like young kids get killed by, oh, drive by, whatever, <laughs> loose, loose bullet, fuck it. Yeah. It just hit a kid. It wasn't meant to the kid, boom, or whatever, right? Tell me how this nigga almost died from a fucking rock, nigga. <laughs> like, Going 90 fuck? miles per hour past my face. Like, nigga, that shit go one That shit would've rocked your shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it would've been over for Oh, yeah, probably. That brain damage, Pompele it would've been gone, nigga. That would've been gone, nigga. They would've signed this paper That was going crazy. probably faster than 90. Money, they would've signed this paper already. Crazy. That's, 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 I've, I've done dangerous shit, but I don't, think, I don't think I've never been in a situation like that. So can, let's move forward. Going, so if the day goes on, the sun is getting real low. Mm-hmm. I mean, no, yeah, real low. You're like, what the fuck? What the fuck? You passed six o'clock? Nah, it was, it was still like three. It was three something. Three? Three? It was probably, probably, probably winter. Fall, winter. Winter. What happened? I was in. It was in the morning when it, it was warm. It was warm. Okay. Mm, okay. So it was in the morning and the sun was still up. So I tried to get. Okay, so I left. I'm like, I'm not doing this no more. You, you either follow me or you stay here and die. <laughs> um, all right, so I'm going. And I'm like going walking back towards my school. So he's following me. He's like, yo, there's a gate, right? I'm like, okay, I see the gate. And he's like, look what's inside. It's a hot dog truck inside of the gate. Okay. Mind you, the gate on the top of it has spikes. So. What kind of spikes? Bro. Like those round ones, right? You're not getting over. <laughs> That's the kind of spikes it is. He's like, you're not getting over. The spikes, the longest shit. I'll tell that. you why this shit felt like a movie to me. It's I look movie. away. I look over. He's a fucking. He's on the other side of the gate, bro. This, this you go, yo, yo, go, yo, yo. I have no. quite, I have, I have questions about your looking over. Do you look over for like three hours or like? <laughs> no, no, no. I look over because I, I'm be, I be doing things. I be like, I don't think this is a good idea because I'm looking for a truancy. I'm looking for, you know, my mom. I'm, I'm just aware of my surroundings. Like, where are we? So it's I'm like just, my mom pull up. You know, I'm like, getting my ass beat right here. Mind you, the, the gate, it, the gate had nowhere to go. Once you win, you win. So I don't know why he did that. So he's like, Mel, I just hopped over. So hop over with me. Hop over with me. You know what I did? You hopped over, didn't you? I tried to hop over. <laughs> he tried. But I stopped. And I was like, nah, I'm going. I'm leaving now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. So as I'm walking, I hit the corner. He's still in the gate. I hit the corner. And he's trailing me. So how did he leave that gate? I don't know. <laughs> it's still a mystery to this day. Who is this nigga, man? I don't oh, know. Bro. I still don't know. Bro, I Who know, is this I nigga? knew him. 
You don't, don't know him know. no more. <laughs> I don't, I don't, he might not be alive. Yeah, he might, think, not, be alive. He might not be alive. I don't think he's around. He might not be alive. I don't think he's around. He around. has to be. Uh, this conversation is. He has to be. <laughs> <laughs> no, because he was doing. He was. He was magical. This nigga said hocus pocus pile of rocks. You know what I'm saying hocus pocus over the gate. <laughs> and that's not even. You know what I mean? Hocus pocus behind Mel. Like what? Like who is this nigga? Oh, some scary David shit. Bain? What's his, what's his <laughs> name? The, the magician nigga was his name? I didn't know. That's why movie. No, that nigga, that nigga's a movie. His life is a movie. <laughs> Hopefully he's still alive making movie yeah, shit. I think he is. But all right, so, all right, so we go, we go, get to the school. His mom's there. Oh, which, which, why you go to school? Take him away, mind you. Now I'm by myself now. I'm trying to get back into school and everything. All of a sudden I look back, and it's a police officer. Behind me, right? Oh God! Hocus pocus, police but officer. Here's the funny part. Hocus pocus, but, cops. but here's the here's the funny part. <laughs> my mom is sitting in the passenger seat of a police car. Of a police car. Oh shit! Oh, Been looking for me all day since this morning because teachers already <laughs> called me and said I didn't come to school. Of course. The principal and all that because I'm in school. They know me for being Melvin. Okay. You know, if I'm not dead, and Melvin ain't dead. Yeah. So she was alert. She was driving in the cop car all day looking for me. Do you know what kind of ass whooping I got? I, I could picture one, yeah. I could imagine one. The cop went to whoop my ass. That's how much my ass <laughs> <laughs> The cop was like, oh, I don't whoop your ass because I'm a fool. Mm. <laughs> Mind you, the day wasn't even over for her, so I had to go to her job. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, you were just sitting in the job. You knew this ass whooping was coming. That, that, yo, you know you, those are the worst Those are the worst. Bro? The worst. Like, you contemplating this ass whooping, bro. How can you, I contemplate when I got my ass whooped at her job? <laughs> oh shit! Three <laughs> the Oh, you got two ass whoopings. Two. So that that's the story of the Quadro, bullshit I'll, that I'll, I've learned from I'll it. I never tried. Go this nigga said, "I'm never doing that shit again. Never skip school ever again. Perfect attendance. Never was know. late." <laughs> Cuatro. Dime tú. Dime tú. ¿Cuántos años tuviste en Santo Domingo? Yo, yo lo como digo, yo soy deportado de allá, loco. Yo nací aquí, en verdad yo soy americano y soy okay. Yo nací aquí, pero ya a los cinco me deportaron para allá, como yo digo. Ajá. Me dejaron para allá, para allá. Para allá, para allá. ¿Hasta cuándo, ¿Cuándo tú volviste? Yo volví a los doce. A los doce, okay. Siete años de deportación. Es como nosotros. Es como casi, nosotros, casi. Igual. Yo me fui a los cinco Deportado. hasta los siete. <risa> Deportación. Ok. Estaba allá yo malísimo. Me, me decían Bilade. Ok, ¿Qué? dame, dame una, un, una anécdota, un cuento. Dilo en inglés para que no lo entienda. So he can laugh with us. Uh, you gotta say it in English, okay? Yeah. Tell me what what, the, what are the worst things you did me? while you was in DR as a kid with your group of friends? Because you know it's always with a group of friends. It's never you by yourself. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah. I promise you it's never you by yourself. And nah. DR is never you by yourself, bro. It's the whole block. Like, it's what? the entire no block, bro. I promise oh, God. you. It is. Block. Oh, God. Like, never you by yourself? Never, bro. You never do some right, stupid so shit. This is what it was, right? Shit. When I was in my dad's house, right? I was always like, it was only me and my brother. Like, we had cousins and friends around and shit. But I think I used to be treated like a fucking, like I was rich. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> I ain't gonna hold you. you Bobby, from the States. Yeah. Bobby, from and, uh, Bobby, used to, Bobby used to run track in the Hall of, he was in the Hall of Fame. He's a, he's, a, he's a master construction thing. I thought, so, yeah. Hall of Fame of what? Track running. For who? In Dia? Yeah, in Dia. Well, he run? Uh, 100 meters. 100 meter dash. Ooh. Sprinting niggas. Fast niggas. I'm so sure. Yeah, like five three. That's what he got. Oh, that nigga fast as shit. Take it in, come with So it's like, and then when I used to go to my grandmother's house, right? And I got my name to sell and he's out. And like, that shit was like, I used to be all my cousins. So we used to be like, siempre en el río o en la playa. But like, one of the worst thing we ever did was like, I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> it wasn't even in the oil, my nigga. It was here. Yeah, I gave it all. Oh my God, nigga, it was here, <laughs> he didn't bro. learn. He didn't learn nah, when he went to the oil. It wasn't even me. It wasn't even me, bro. nigga. But you was there, so it was you. <laughs> it was, bro, so let me tell you, right? This happened in my cousin's graduation, bro. He, oh my! He literally God. about to graduate, so. You know I'm about to, he didn't graduate because he did that nah, bullshit. Nah, he graduated. Oh, he graduated. I, I, no, I, I gotta ask these questions, bro. The thing was, <laughs> this was the thing. The thing was, it was like me, my brother, and my cousin. Mm. We was like, yo, we gotta get an outfit to go to graduation. The graduation to the stadium. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So everybody's gonna be there. Open graduation. Everybody goes. So we go in there. It's hot. It's fucking like July. I sort of yo, it's hot <laughs> shit. My nigga. So we go in there. We go to Old Navy and shit. Mm. And then my cousin be like, yo, these shit don't got time. Just take that shit. So oh, like, my God. <laughs> you know, they caught your shit, didn't they? My nigga, I ain't gonna hold you. 
I had everything in my bag, and then like my, my brother phone was dead, my cousin phone was dead, my cousin was about to, he was like, yo, I'm about to go pay for this shit, right? And then we gonna get a bag, and then we gonna throw everything. I'm like, throw everything, fuck it. We throw everything in the bag, nigga. I ain't gonna hold your stupid shit ever. I stopped, like I got out the store, and I literally stopped in front of the store and just like posted, waiting for my cousin to get out. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo, you, you 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 never robbed in your life, have you, huh? But I ain't gonna, that was like, I ain't gonna hold you, that was like the first time, I ain't gonna hold you. This when I had the worst thing, I ain't gonna hold you when they put me in there, funny as shit, but get They take was, you to the back room, like, yeah, they, like they the do in the movie? Room. No, yeah. they do in the movie, they kind of take you to the back room, but the yeah, fuck, yeah, why, why am I in the back room? Y'all niggas just perverts. The like, I'm fucking 12, why, right. why am I in the back room, nigga? <laughs> With no parents, no supervision. Facts, facts. Oh, let, let me go, you fucking pervert ass <laughs> niggas. Yo, I ain't gonna hold you, they put me down there, and they was like, what's your name? They're like, what's your name? I was like, Pedro. Fake name. I was like, Jordan. He was like, Jordan what? Alvarez. Where you live? One, two, three, four, five Avenue. I see me on one, two, three, four, five Avenue. I see me on the hell they here. So tell me why. They was like, you got anybody that's here in the mall? I'm like, yeah, yeah. I didn't call my brother. Yo, I didn't know how his phone was on. I called my brother. That nigga came with uh, my cousin, my cousin girl's mom. She was in the mall. I don't know how the fuck she was in the mall. He nigga found somebody. Tell me why. This nigga, they asked this nigga, yo, what's his name? Do not wait. Right away, he's like, did it that? Where's his butt there? But I'm like, God damn. He's looking at this nigga like, God damn. Like, like, thank you, my G. Like, thank you. Like, God damn. Like, I, I even text you this. Like, I texted this beforehand. Like, <laughs> Beforehand, yeah. nigga, my name is Jordan and my address is one two three five, nigga. <laughs> this nigga said, "Nah, your name is Fulanito de Dad." <laughs> Fuck, boy, like why you gotta yeah, say you know, that? I got my ticket in the mail. I had to pay that shit slowly. Sorry, mommy. I was young. Disrespectful, bro. Neg- <laughs> ne- negro. Um, now that we talk, we talking about American shit, right? It's shit that we did in America. What what is something you did in America that mommy didn't find out? Because if she did, she would have you wouldn't be here. Right? You oh, wouldn't she, be here. That right she now, didn't yeah. find out. Oh, tell that me one that she did find out. That was a holdup. Well, one one that she didn't find out. Um, and and just so you see, like sometimes as kids, we don't really we don't really think about the things that we do. Um, there was this Seven Eleven um a block away from the school that I used to walk to. Um, and you know the you know wait, the wait, wait, what school? Uh, I used to I used to go to school up in uh, Massachusetts in Lynn. Uh, Damn, you was young as hell. Yeah, bro. Englewood Elementary, I think it was. Um, it had, it had a rocket, it had a rocket in the logo. Um, okay. like, like, part I'm going of, on a trip on my favorite rocket <laughs> shit. Uh-huh. One of them niggas, one of them niggas. One so, of them niggas. so, you know, you know, back then there was, uh, well, the story is today, but you know, those, you know, those pencils that you would click and it would like had the. the the, the plastic pencils? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, the one with the lead come out. Yeah, with the lead. Yeah, that one, that one, that one, that one. So, exact. No, 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 no. <laughs> so, so that was the thing, right? So for some reason, bro, I don't know why, and I wasn't like I was doing work either, but I just felt the need that I need to have one, one of those pencils. <laughs> um, my mom wasn't going to buy them. Right, because no, I, a pack of four. No, no, the one, no, the one with the lights. The one with the lights. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was a pencil. I definitely no, but it's different. There were one that was on the inside and those. Oh, no, 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 no. And then you, you had the booty ones. No, you, no, the booty ones. ones. The booty you, you, ones. You, you're talking about the ones that you would take it out and then put it on the top again? Yeah. No, 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 no. That's the events after that. Yeah. No, ones that you would just click and the level come out. I feel like it was just too much. They was doing too much at that point. Because it was breaking those. Was thinner, like it kept getting thinner. Like, psh, yeah, I'm about to change it now. So, anyway, so at that point, right, um, I just felt the need that I needed to have those pencils, and I guess I would lose them every day. So, I would go every day to the 7 Eleven. Um, I would go, I would, you know, go walk my aisles because I had like, I had like a I had like a routine, right? I would walk in, I would make the right, and then I would go up the aisle, down the aisle, up the aisle, stop at the pencils, look at the pencils, yeah. go up, up, down the aisle, then stop at a random spot, not even do anything, just look, just go through things and look. Then I would go to another aisle, stop and look again, not do anything, and then walk out the door. Well, no, because the thing is, like, my thing is, like, I wanted to make it as if, like, I was looking to buy, but I would never buy. Um, but he would go every day. But I would go shopping. But I would go every day. I would go every day, right? Bugging. But hear, hear me out. This was my technique, right? So I would never take a whole pack, right? So what I would do is I would open a pack, take one pencil out, and leave the open pack all the way in the back. 
opposite. So, you, see, so, you see what I'm getting at? You see what I'm getting time, at? Okay. So every time you go Wait. in 7 Eleven, you see that shit open pack. It was negro. Exactly. <laughs> so the thing was like, you couldn't say I took a pack. There was no way it was going to ring because I don't have anything on me. I just have literally the pencil. That's all I have, right? Um, I did this for, I don't know for how long. I did this for a while, to be honest, before they even noticed. And then, um, and then one day, I walk in, I see this guy, you know, black, everything black. And I, and I just found it weird that he was just standing there. I just found it weird. Yeah, I found it weird. But I, but I pay no mind. I pay no mind. I do my, my regular routine. I did my regular routine. Up and down my aisle, stop by my pencils, take my pencil out. Because the thing is, I would take it out and then I would like, I would have sleeves. So I would slide it into the sleeve. Boom. And then just keep on going through my routine. Yeah. So then, at the, so then, so then they stopped me. And he's like, oh, um, give it up. And I'm like, give up what? He's like, what you took? What did I take? <laughs> and no, listen to me. I'm eight, nine. Oh, and snap. and I'm like, what did I take? He's like, you know, you took something. And I'm like, nope, I don't think I took anything. <laughs> and then and then the and then the guy um the guy from Seven Eleven comes um comes from behind. He's like, oh, you 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 come here, you come here every week, come here. Right? I'm like, yo, I'm I'm bro, I'm I'm, I'm I'm yeah, I don't need you. I come here, I just come here because I, I'm looking for something that I saw at Seven Eleven that you guys don't have. And I come here every week hoping that you guys have it. I'm out here like really like spitting it. Yeah. 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 This nigga trying to get the fuck out of this bitch. Yeah. This nigga then, getting out of not, this shit. Yeah, I'm real. getting out of this Keep bitch. All, right? Yeah. And yo, and at this point, at this point, I'm like, yo, I gotta go to school. I gotta go to school. They're like, no, I'm gonna lock you up. The police is coming. I'm like, sure. Literally, I'm literally just imagine, yo, just a nine year old saying, okay, sure. Like, cause I was just like, yo, you, you can't, you can't, you can't, you don't have no proof. He's like, oh, we caught you in camera. I'm like, what camera? Because I already spotted all the cameras. Like, the one thing that I did before, like, I scouted the place. It was like... You want a prison break? Huh? You want a prison break when you like use a, Yeah, you like no, a no, no. <laughs> Yeah, and you know what it was? I think that's what it was. You used to play Spin and Cell. Uh, I don't know what that is. Spin and Cell? No, I don't know. Spin and Cell? No, nigga. So, 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 like, that's how I looked at it. I looked at it as a mission. Like, can I get away with this mission? Can I get away with this mission? So... Point is, point is the you know the black niggas like um the the guys dressing all black like nah you're gonna get locked up we're gonna call the cops and I was just like okay cool like you know so I'm like yo should can you get me a chair so I can sit and wait for the cops because I ain't got no problem because I don't I don't got nothing yeah. and like so then they start going through my backpack oh. and I'm like there's nothing there's there's work you know what I mean there's used pencils <laughs> you know what I mean and um so as I'm walking out literally i guess i got nervous and i forgot to like hold my thing and then the pencil drops out of my thing oh. but then you know what i did it dropped and i just threw my backpack i literally because i had my backpack on the same shoulder so when it dropped i just dropped my backpack with it once i noticed it was on the floor so it looked like if the pencil like oh, right, came out right, of right. kind of oh, okay. picked up left ne never ne went back to never, went back. Again. never went back oh, and then i moved across the street they had a candy store across the street and then i got caught the candy store too but they yeah, didn't call the cops yo you trying to hit everything yeah, I was hitting everything at the candy. No, but at the candy shop, this is what I would do at the candy yeah, shop. Like at the candy, <laughs> but 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 I'm I'm, my mind got had no air but, force. Money. Yo, but the, but the thing was like the candy one it was so stupid. Now that I think about it, just the way that I went about it, like I was literally stealing in front of the lady's face, literally, I literally. literally. So yeah, because there was a candy store where like you know you open the things and you could put a certain amount of candy in the bag and then they oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. It was one of those, right? So the yeah, candy that I want, the candy that I wanted, <laughs> like here's the counter, right? And then it was. First lane, second lane, right, quick, quick, third quick. lane, right? Which so, candy? I didn't forget what the candy was, to be Don't honest with you. Don't say it was some corn candy. Some cr yeah, so oh, what I would do is... <laughs> so, <laughs> yo, I so this is what so I would like do. Him, yeah. <laughs> I would I would drop down, right? Like, look through the candy. Oh, I like this one. Oh, I like, like this one. Through, through. And what I would do is I will be like this, like opening with this one, but with this hand, I'd be like taking candy. But I can't just keep the candy in my hand, so I would do like this. Uh, and I would put all the candy in my mouth and just close my mouth. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I think I think around I think around like the third time I think like around the third time she goes like you open your mouth and I'm like hmm <laughs> <laughs> <She's> like, <laughs> 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 open your mouth and then and then and then, and then, I, and then I open my mouth and she's like all the candy she's like yo get the fuck out of here. Um, but yeah, I used to I used to be Dang, pretty that's bad. The worst way. Yeah, I used to be pretty bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, and, and, and that's like those are like the nice versions of my stealing. Yeah. Nice version. Yeah. yeah I just, I, I, no, and, and you know what it was? I always try to I always try to look back at like yo, what was driving me to do that? Like you know what I mean? Like I never quite was able to put like something on it, but I was I was doing a lot of stealing just without the need because it wasn't like I needed it. 
is I just I guess the adrenaline. I think it was really the adrenaline that I, that I was looking for. No, manito, man, no, manito, man, yo me puse un tiempo, man, cuando estaba malo, bro. Yo, nigga, I used to wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning to, like, steal from my mom. Yeah, my mom would, like, so my mom would always, like, prepare herself to, like, um, to, like, like, for the next day of work. So she would put, like, her, you know, her clothes, her, her wallet, blah, 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 blah. I would wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning, go through her wallet, and I would literally dictate, depending on the type of money that she had, like, the amount of bills of each one. So like if she had like let's say like two, yeah let's say like she had like two hundreds she had like eight twenties she had like you know three fives two ones I would know that that day I could only take from the twenties because the twenty was the larger amount and it was easier for that to be unrecognized yeah yeah like, <laughs> but yeah, I was pretty. Yeah, I was pretty. I was pretty bad. I was pretty bad when I was growing up. Nah, nigga, it's, I, I wasn't. I wasn't that bad though. Like my shit, my shit. But, but no, in the Estados Unidos, you don't say nah. Yo hacía más en San Domingo. Yo robaba mango. Why not? Never did nothing. ¿Cómo tú te robas a mango? Me tiran en el patio los tigres. Ah, pues te lo tiran. Sí, we used to, we used to go. We used to climb on top of the guys. We used to climb fences like the nigga. Like hocus pocus, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We, no, literally, we just we climb, we climb fences. We used to take the money. You know what I'm saying? Oh, All that shit. Cuando la derramé, they shot at us. Oh, they shot at us. They, they shot at us once. What? No, what? 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 A shotgun. What? A shotgun. Qué bueno. Yeah. So, so there was this guy. So no, no. Let me, let me, let me, let me tell the story because I, I, I don't. I was the slowest nigga that back then, right? So we in this place. Speed, speed, oh. running, running shit. No, no, I was just slow. I was just slow. I was skinny as hell. I was skinny, skinny, skinny but slow. Slow as fuck. So I was, I was also seven years old. Seven, mm. nine at this time. This nine years old. That, I, my athleticism is not here yet. You know what I'm saying? I'm still slow. I'm a slow motherfucker. <laughs> These niggas is all fast. The niggas that are from the country, they. Ready to run wherever they go, you know what I'm saying? So them niggas is fast. The them young niggas is still fast. So we in this in this um what's it called? This farm. It's straight up oranges, mangoes, everything. This this nigga has Can everything. And the, he has his house in the middle of that shit. But this shit is big. So you don't even no, see he, his house. No, no, he had one on the his house wasn't in the middle. Oh. He had one in the right side in the corner. On the second. I want Yeah, 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 but yeah. I'm talking about his house. It, there wasn't a house in the There's middle. There's a house in the middle. No, there isn't. Usted, no, usted, no, una pregunta, una pregunta, pero. No, in the middle, oh. in the middle estaba la, la mata de mango injecto. Okay. Espérate, pero una pregunta. Okay. Ustedes hace llaman a ese tío, digo mañanos. No, no, no. No, <laughs> no we weren't like we weren't even on that on that time. Over yeah. There. So we oh, we out there, <laughs> we taking like oranges and like we had shirts like yeah, we shirts like filled, that, like dead ass, oh, like yeah. Yeah. hella fucking una pregunta, shit. Una pregunta, otra pregunta. Go ahead. Y esos mangos, ¿cómo te lo tumbaba? Es un mango, nada más de mango injeto, son chiquitas. Son yeah, chiquitas. Los mangos, los mangos. ¿Cuál mango? Big ¿Los largos? Los no, no, injeto, no. Los injeto, los huge ones. They look like coconuts. Big ass yeah. mangos, like this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah big ass shit. So, that tree is low. That tree is not a big it's not tree. As high, it's not as high as the regular mango tree. Okay, so there's three mango trees, right? Three mango trees. It's the big ass shit which has the longer mangoes, the one that you probably see in the store, yeah. the longer mm -hmm. ones. Then there's like round mangoes that are like this. Lo that tree is a regular sized tree. Lo de vanille, mi gente. Yeah. Lo de vanille. Lo de vanille. Yeah. Lo vanille. Yeah. They're, they're not. They're not that tall. This is a regular tree. It's a regular tree. Yeah, a regular tree. Boom. But then there's the big shit so like this that the tree is literally you go like it's a trunk. It's like, like you my can stand. size. You can just stand and grab. The tree is like my size. Oh. Right. So we that nigga has like three trees in the middle, like with this big, like this shit is big. So we all in that shit. We see that tree. Oh, yeah, like we see that game. tree. We all go. It's like how many of us? Like seven. Yeah, like seven, seven, of seven of us, bro. <laughs> like little kids. Wolf pack. There was probably like <laughs> two or three that are like negro age. They were like ten to fourteen in that like range. Yeah, was like wolf pack. And then there's a bunch of little niggas. Oh, so we get we 
full filled like this, and all you hear in the background, this nigga, we all eating, we still in the tree eating these mangoes. We, we chilling, chilling, chilling. Chillin'. Chillin'. Everybody, everybody, like, everybody got house. their their oranges, their all that shit. We we <laughs> packed like we we took everything from that nigga. That ass, that <laughs> over there, some heist. My nigga, we we were in there right, and out of nowhere you hear. We were I, like chikla chikla, oh, nigga. Hell yeah, no. nigga we all, nigga, we all started running. But, but you I know, I, there are fences that had barbed wire. Yeah. Right. So all the all everything in DR has barbed wire. Everything. Everything. Yeah, so we ran, we ran, boom, 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 and all I see is niggas just going like, cause I'm the slowest nigga. I'm in the back. Like I see everybody go through this barbed wire, and everybody just. <laughs> Like, like I never there's seen no, niggas, there's no stopping. It's literally like one motion. I never <laughs> seen niggas go through the barbed wire like this, and I'm like, God damn! Like, what am I gonna do? Am I gonna jump the barbed wire? I, like, I'm thinking about the dun, dun, dun. so I'm like, fuck it! I'm doing the the ducking roll, and I'm saying that put the leg in, room, and keep running. That's what everybody was doing. Yeah. Boom. But again, I'm the slowest nigga. But at this time, when I'm like ten, I'm also one of the tallest niggas. Right, so I'm I'm already growing. Like this yeah. is my growth spurt is coming in, and I'm like awkward, big. Like everything you, is what's going on. Flexible? What's he flexible? I, I'm growing at this time. You know when the kid is growing, their knees hurt. The, everything yeah. like I'm I'm Blanky. awkward right now. I'm just Blanky. skinny and big, nigga. And I'm yeah. like nah, nah, nah. so I go, I do the duck roll. Nigga already in the fucking almost at the house. I'm like boom boom duck roll. My shirt stays stuck. I just rip that shit. I scratch my back. My shit open. I'm running. Everybody get there, right? When we noticed that we were out, we were like, bro, did y'all hear the the gun go off? Because we heard the the, the, the clack, 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 and we just ran. But in, in between us running, like the first two niggas went boom, boom. There's two niggas from over there. Them niggas knew what the fuck they were doing. Them niggas said, wah, wah. And then out of nowhere, when they went, wah, wah, all I hear is, bah, bah. And I'm like, Oh nah, this nigga trying to get us. Oh. But he, he huh? You heard yeah, he shot, but he shot it up. He didn't shoot it. Yeah, he, he knew who we was. Nah, he knew who he, he, he was. He knew who he was. He went to our grandpa. And was like, <laughs> he said, nah, nah. But our grandpa was like, ustedes no saben robar. He said, y'all niggas don't know how to go to a place and steal. Why would you stay there? But uh, not, not have to be all embarrassed because he didn't really give a fuck because he had oranges and all that shit. We just wanted to go to that nigga shit. <laughs> yeah, it's like, literally in front of that shit. It's like, we're here, right? Our grandpa house, this is the house, right? This is the house. And then he has the whole back fill of oranges and shit. Aguacate and all that shit. He has all. Like, we don't even so need to go to this nigga shit. And we just went. Exactly, exactly. We didn't have to go to that He had that guys. guayabas, though. We didn't have guayabas on our side. No, nah, but there was guayabas, guayabas down the block. Yeah, guayabas down the block. No, nah, he had the good shit. He had the, the small. Where you go is like just. Because we were li- cause like we we lived, we lived in the, the capital, but we also lived in the country lived, countryside. Wait, wait, wait. We lived like in the wait, city, wait. and then we lived wait, in the country. Where y'all from? De la capital, de los mina. Los mina y Atomayor. Sí, pero nosotros también no creamos en Atomayor del Rey. That's that's like country, bro. Yeah. There are horses everywhere. Like in Los Mina, you see horses with a, with the carriage. No, nah. in in Atomayor del Rey, you see niggas on horses. Type shit. Yeah. Like they do like horse, the they do horse parades, back riding. Like niggas in the cars. Like the wives are driving the cars, and the men are in horses. Just they have wagons for in the right miles, riding. nigga. And then they get to a spot. Everybody's there. It's music a party. is bumping. Niggas is drinking hella kids everything Saco me like caballo, but, uh, and por todo lado sure. but niggas, sure. yes of course horses are gonna shit but we didn't Don't pay lie. mind to that shit we never paid mind to that shit <laughs> there, there was cows everywhere we had chickens everywhere we had everything everywhere oh, and we didn't campo. yeah campo campo, 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 campo. no había yeah, loot type campo like, yeah, like that bad so like no electricity no type shit no electricity so it smell different down there? Like, like, I mean well, you really don't pay mind to that shit you know what you get used to it one you get one you get used to it but you also have to understand like there's certain areas where there's more than others right so like when you would take the cows in the morning to um to get a how's your dinner in uh, English? Milked. To get milked, right? So like we would wake up four or five o'clock in the morning to go get the cows to put them up at the at the like a it was like a little square where you put them all together. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And well, you would the, keep, you you would bring them back to their cage because this how, this, this is this is how this, this how, is real country shit. This is country way. shit. Yeah. This is country <laughs> shit. Od. This is how the cows stay with milk once they have uh, the, 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 what's it the, called? The, the, the cattle. The, the cattle, right? Mm-hmm. When they have the cattle, you separate them after a time in the day, right? After Usually after five after or six. After five, you separate them so the cattle doesn't drink all the milk. So you separate them, you take the cattle 
up to where we're gonna take the cows the next morning. They're already there. Mm-hmm. And so you them lock them niggas, away. Them niggas is hungry than a motherfucker, bro. Like them niggas is hungry as shit. So we take the cows in the morning and they do you know the cattle know their mom. They, you know, everybody yeah. like yeah. babies know their mom all the time. So we know the cow that's coming, and we open the door. The cattle for that cow comes out. Cause that nigga knows what it is. That nigga's like, "Whoop, I'm out of here." He gets <laughs> onto it. Kid. He gets onto it. Blah blah blah. He starts drinking. Baby, once like once he drink. presses it, that the, the milk the, is already in this, the like the, the cow titty. Yeah. So so what you do is it's it's a pre, it's a, prep, it's a preparation. Right? It's a preparation. So what you do is um first you tie up the the, the, cow's the cow itself. So the cow don't kick the exactly. Shit out you tie the 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 cow's legs. It's like an eight. Kick. It's like an eight. Like right. That. And if it's and if it's a real real no, bad no, cow, you you, you tie you tie their the, head to, tie the to, head like to a, a stick to, to like a, a trunk of a tree. Trunk. You stuck it there so exactly. so it doesn't like horn you. So it doesn't horn you. Anything, so right? it's the, it's that and then the legs. Exactly. So then what you do? You bring the cattle out and you have the yeah for real. Then you have the cattle suck on every single titty until it's almost like it's gonna sound. This is part of the worst analogy I can say, but until it's hard. Right, literally, because yeah. the thing is, like, you need to make sure that the milk right is already like coming down, yeah. right? So once one of them is set, what you do is you move the, you cattle, move the cattle from you that one that's set out, to one put, that isn't. Like you literally grab my hair, you go flop, flop, and then you the other one. exactly, the thing, and the then you do the same thing for all four. And then but once everything is is ready, you move that nigga. Be like, yo, you, and you, then somebody t- that, keep well, that nigga away. He's scared of you. It depends. Well, the, once again, it depends on the cow, right? Some cattle, you have to keep them close. So just so that, so the cow can think that the cattle is the one that is drinking the milk, yeah. right? Others you could just push it away, but there's certain cows they have to keep it so. And then you have somebody who comes and you know just takes the milk out the cow. And once you know once they're almost done, then they let they the let, they let, let the, the cow cattle go, and then the cattle too. And, and the cattle too. Stay, it's like a spot. The cattle is in a little spot, right? All the cows are here. Once we're done with that cow, you leave the cattle out with the cows because he could just drink whatever milk is left. Thing. And yeah, he'll drink visually for each cow, each every cow, single cow. cow. You can't do them all together, bro. Well, we'll in 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 America, there's, in America, a, much, there's a much they faster. They put a machine. They put machines and shit, right? Right, but you know, I'm talking about yeah. like literally. And we would take like it was it was like three <laughs> buckets of cow milk, like three. Yeah, buckets you of you, cow you, milk. you you. And our grandpa would take that to the to the what? like cow milk, like so three you, big ass shit. Like, so, oh, so you know the you know the shit that you see in the movies with the the horses and they have like these two like silver metal big bucket things next to them. All right, so we were so we we were for more than three. We were for maybe like around like six or eight yeah. and then those he six a lot of cows yeah he did, he did have, grandpa. yeah he did have a lot of cows so those six peace. those six or eight I things know. you put them in the back of the truck and then you know you go to the city, city? part of the to of the, the town country. to, to the, the town yeah you take it's it to the town shit. and, and in the town shit. you sell it to the thing that does like all the, all the cheeses and all the whatnot and then oh, that's oh, how he used to make his money and that's how he used to make money Never, never, never. Did no, that. the guys. Are, the, I, I, Los Tigres del Campo, Campo, Los Tigres del Campo, Campo, si. Like again, the guys that live there. Like we used to go I there. Like I didn't, I didn't like the milk. You're done yet? I did, I did the milk. milking. I, I milked before. I milked a cow before. I just, I just never liked the milk though. Saco baja. I, I liked it though. I liked the milk. I, I didn't like the milk. Saco baja. No, no, my my boy. This nigga out here going like. Now I like the milk itself. Like when you bo- after because. When, After you boil it? when you take it out, you have to boil it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it could take all the the, the bacteria. It would just kill it. That's how the butter. Right. So you boil it, right? Once you boil it, bro, you you used to make um, dulce leche, like candy with that shit. Like you put that shit, put hella sugar in that motherfucker, and it will get heavy. You put. Uh, uh, cinnamon oh, yeah. and all that shit. Yeah, like you, like you would make a lot of shit with to, it. We used to make the candy. You know how when you put like lemon and, and, and milk, it just like gets all nasty and shit? Yeah. We used to do that for the candy. We used to put lemon in it so it could get like chunky, like cheese. But it was sweet, bro. That shit was rocking. Yeah. Crazy. How's the consist- consistency of the, of the milk yeah. itself? It's I, regular I, milk. It well, just, it's it, consistent. It just tasted different. It tasted it. So I tried it once, and that's that's why I didn't. I wasn't capable of doing it. It was just um, it's the heavier. S- it's heavier, but the smell killed me. Like yeah, I can't, like, I can't do it with the smell. Because sm- it doesn't I'm smell. Milk guy. It doesn't like smell it. like regular milk. Heavy like cream, yeah, heavy. Yeah, 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 much creamier, much creamier. No, the but the thing is, throw in. But the thing is, like the, s- the smell of it. The smell of it killed. No, not that much, not that much, not that much, not that much. What, what? Like, like he's talking about like the consistency as in like. No, no, you, not you, you could tell the difference because processed milk is like they probably put water and all that shit. Yeah. yeah. So you could tell the difference, but it's you know not. It's nothing like it? crazy. It's not crazy. You know when you pour it, you know the milk from here when you pour it, you can see like the little water on it. 
You see a little It's like clear? Yeah. yeah, you see a little dip in the two shades. Yeah, uh, you see two there. shades. You see a straight white. Uh, okay. And it tastes different. It, I it, 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 it does taste different. And it smells different, like negative shit. Yeah, the smell, smell, the smell I can't do. I didn't give a fuck. No, no, no. It just right. has a stronger smell. It just smell. has yeah. a stronger smell. You know how you how there's cheeses that have a strong ass smell, and then the other cheese that doesn't smell like nothing? Same thing, same thing. It's that same thing. And I just, I couldn't handle the smell. The country shot, the country shot is different. Oh, this is funny. This is funny. We went. To a river, right? Boom, boom, boom. And then, no, we went to the river, boom, boom, to, to a, a part of the river that was deep. So we all swimming at this point, right? We all could swim, whatever, boom, boom, boom. We there. And there's like pineapple just in the thing, right? So we're like, oh, shit, we about to take pineapple and go eat that shit at the house, at the crib, right? Fuck it, boom. We take pineapple, boom, 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 boom. And we, no, no, but uh, this pineapple, pineapple just grew like no, 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 like what? It's not like the person wanted the pineapple to be there. It's probably like somebody a, ate pineapple there, left the it there, just, and then the tree grew. Tree just grew. No way. I yeah. promise you. So there was a lot. There was a lot of pineapple. Ooh, that, that, so we took a couple because yeah. there were some of them that weren't ready. So we just took the one that were ready, right? Boom. And when we're going back, there is this uh, bull. Oh yeah, the this bull. white bull. White bull. A big with the with the one with the ball that's in the back. Like these bulls that have like a, like a lump on they the top. Have a lump in the back. My nigga, this nigga don't see us. You know, he eating normal grass, boom, boom, boom. And we a group. And I think two of us had red shirts on. And I like I never thought the bulls really went after red shit. I don't like, know. Who yeah. I never I never thought that shit. But you know Spain niggas really do that yeah, shit. Yeah. So I'm thinking I, these niggas is trained to fight like I'm thinking this is a show they train them to follow the rat. Oh. I don't think that's nature. I'm not thinking that's nature. I'm dead ass not thinking that's nature. Like I Bogan. Two of us have a red shirt. My nigga, this nigga don't go. Conk, conk, and then just looked and went voom. And then you see this nigga just big ass bull chest like that and oh. just looking at us and we're like oh, oh. Nah, oba, oba. <laughs> oba, oba. dead oba, ass oba. he went oba oba on our oba. ass bro we were we were jacking we were boom, 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 pineapple falling we just mm. nigga but in this side we can't duck and, and go because the the sticks of the fence is not as wide they're like mm. this so these niggas is just stepping on bob wire boom, boom, up boom, boom, up come on Oh, but the and, one, nah, cause they know they know the Bob White have a space. A space I don't know how these niggas see that shit when you're running though, cause I didn't see that shit. <laughs> so my chancleta stay. Oh. Yeah, my chancleta, mi samurai, una se quedó y la otra porque I but stepped I and up. I and I just jumped over. Did Boom, my chancleta stayed <laughs> stuck on the Bob White and I just ran. <laughs> but this nigga was come. You, you remember that yeah, nigga? That nigga was like, brruh, brruh, brruh. you hit, you will hear that nigga steps, bro. Brugutu, brugutu, brugutu on your ass. I dead ass, bro. Bo, 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 there's no bo, bo, way. Bo, 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 yeah, there's, there's, there's. I remember. Oh, and that, the, in the countryside, we, there's hella shit that we get. I mean, yeah, we have, we have, we have. We have hella you know stories. stories. You know what it is? In the yard, you feel free. Like, How is it? Over here, like, it? There's definitely a sense of freedom that everybody they, broke. They everybody broke a shit, yeah, but. Bro. You definitely feel free when you're. Yeah, there's, there, there, especially in the countryside. There's a set up. There's a there's a there's oh, a yeah. level of freedom that you don't feel here. Yeah, for sure. And and I'm not sure if the, I don't know if nature plays a role in that. Um, I, I just think the lack of civilization, like buildings and all that shit, hella people going you know around. That could be it. I think it's like like because I'm like, 100% think about, think sure about, like, niggas that live in the countryside here feel different from the yeah, for sure. Yeah, like you know I'll put it to you like this, like. There's a you, you have a different feeling if you stand outside here than if you stand in the middle of like Central Park where just don't don't the, the only grass part, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Okay, there's just, you, you feel different. Yeah. You see what I'm getting But just imagine that at a different level like of you exaggeration. Because in Central Park you can still see the building or the distance. Yeah. yeah. Like literally it's what you nothing. see is mountains and skies. You know, I'm a, I'm gonna keep it a hundred with you. When you go to New York at night, even here, you can't see a lick of stars, not one. Hell no. Bro, in the countryside look, I'm getting like chills, bro. We used to stand like it was night and it was a full moon, no clouds, bro. The whole thing was lit. Yeah, like it was like, like it was light was on, nigga. I promise you. Like you can like, like just just imagine it, it's, it's pure, pure darkness. darkness. It's literally like imagine the, there's no lights outside and it's just pure darkness, right? And imagine the moon just lighting up because without the moon, I can't really see you from here. Like right here, I can't see you. When the moon was out, it was I. I see you just like this. No street lights? Uh, no, no street lights. No, 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 country. The, there's country, no country. street, nigga. Yeah, it's just a road. Oh, it's a road. Dead ass. Like, like you so, actually get a shadow off of the off moon. Off the moon. 
on some real shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, like that's so. We like, would see. We would like. There's sometimes that we would like our parents were playing dominoes, shit. right? And we would just we we had like a little fire. The moon's out, and we just dead ass telling stories, nigga. And there was like every single star. You could see like every star that you could see from the planet, bro. I promise you. You remember yeah. that shit? Like it was like just you, like you know. Like, I'm you, getting chills right you know, now because I haven't seen stars in a long time. Like you know, I was in the ER. The Big Dipper I, I, and the Small Dipper. You can see all that yeah, shit. Yeah, like you, you see everything. You can see all them shits clearly. You can see that shit clearly, bro. Yeah, clearly, yeah, clearly. Yeah. clearly. I I remember another. <laughs> I remember another thing. Negro had a horse uh, out there, right? Oh yeah. So yeah, my yeah, uh, horse. Yeah, no, no, no. He had a horse. It was a horse. And she was beautiful. She was beautiful too. Yeah. Huh? Brown. It was a brown with a with a white with a with a white with a white with a white forehead. What's the name? Rosita. 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 Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, so my uncle had a, a, a another horse, a female, and he gave birth, she gave birth to Negro's horse. And my uncle knew that Negro loved, like, horses. So horses. he was like, fuck it, I'm going to give you this horse. This is your horse. Fuck mm-hmm. it, take it. My uncle had a, a other horses. He was a wow. horse naked, right? right? So he gives Negro the horse, boom, 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 she's growing. When she gets to the age that you have to train her, I remember I was oh, training. God. Yo, that was the <laughs> yeah. that was a pain in the ass, bro. Because <laughs> yeah. you have to you have to uh, domesticate them so you can be able to ride them. Because if they're not, they're, they're, they're wild throwing, animals. Think about it. Going just, crazy on you if you just, just imagine like even like even people who have dogs, right? Like if you don't train your dog at home, it's just a wild dog. It'll go bite anybody. It'll do whatever the fuck it wants. It'll shit anywhere, right? Mm-hmm. So when it comes to the horses, there's a certain mm-hmm. level of domestication that you have to have give them, them. But you need to you know let them develop. To still be able to do that, and you know, at this point when they get to, to that size, you know, that's when the 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 adomar, the how I say it in yeah, Spanish. Yeah. So when you do this training, like it's it's dangerous. It's, harsh. it's a harsh it's dangerous. Training it's dangerous. Like, I feel I mean? bad for the horses too, because it's a harsh training. It's a, it is a harsh training. Just imagine. Okay, I'll put it to you like this. Just imagine getting dizzy. Right, I'm gonna get you dizzy. I'm gonna just have you. You know how they do that game with the baseball bat, and you have to go around, go around, go around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no, imagine somebody, thing. imagine doing some that to you, right? And then after they got you dizzy, they get on top of you. Like That's to crazy ride, to ride you. And then you wailing, whatever. And then you, but you can't to, be really wailing because you. But you can't really wild out yeah. because you're dizzy. So what you do is you you know you, you you know you get them dizzy, and after you get them dizzy, you have already a horse that's already domesticated in front to lead. And then you saddle them up. You know, you put the you know put the thing on, t- and that's even all of this is dangerous. Like you, could, yeah, one of my yeah. boys got kicked and got kicked in the face. Like and this, it's, it's, it's dangerous. So it didn't, sa- it didn't really like it didn't really go crazy because she didn't have like the horseshoes. Yeah, she didn't have like the metal piece. So it didn't really. It's like if somebody kicked you with a nail. It's a, obviously it's, it's a hard kick. Like yeah, got hit hard. But if he had, if she would have had like horseshoes. He would have been probably bleeding or something. So. That happened, right? We had to do it like four or five times, six times, maybe? Yeah, nah, definitely more. Yeah, yeah. Definitely more. It, we, yo, we had her going in around and around. We had to do that for like a couple of days. Why? Because she wasn't a... No, not because you have to get them used to... You have to get them used to it. ...on top of it. Because the thing is like, you can't just do it for one day and they're going to be good. It's and not. It's a training. Go right back, it's like a training. Go right back to you it. have to do it consistently, consistently, consistently. So we would we would do that shit, right? And then fucking... Once that she was like ready or whatever, Negro gets on. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> nigga is like, oh yeah, my horse is ready. Ah uh-uh. ah, like nigga, she not ready. You should let yeah. somebody that you know no. does this shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This nigga, 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 nigga gets on, and she said, "We gone." <laughs> she just dip. Boom. No, 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 and nigga no, no, try no. to. She like, just dip. She just dip to she break, dipped. and she just gone. She just dip. So just imagine me. I'm probably like. 13 I yeah, know, right. on top of a wild animal and I'm talking like no 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 I'm talking like nah, she's gone she's booking she is gone Book, like, 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 like you know when the running, cars pass bro. by and the side look blurry yeah. like that's how fast that, I'm going she was going oh. like I'm going I'm and, going and he like okay where 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 is the 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 McDonald's from here that way no, McDonald's is that way. Yeah. It's pretty yeah, far. Right? Yeah. You know, you know where the McDonald's is yeah. up in Shrink, right? Blocks, From here to over there, it, it's pretty 10, far. 10 it's, blocks, 10, it's pretty far, right? 10, 15 blocks. Okay, so we at our grandpa house, which is here, right? Yeah. There's another house where our friends live at, like our cousins. At. Let's say our cousins. Up the hill. We're, we're up. No, 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 and this nigga just like she he gets on he, she's she's calm for a little bit doop, 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 doop. and then out of nowhere she just says my nigga she got to McDonald's 
so fast. Like Negro, like we saw Negro and we all tried to chase Negro. Once, once yeah. Negro turned that little, like, it was a little corner. We never seen that nigga again. Yeah, and she just kept on going. I was pulling and I was pulling, and people like, wait, wait, where you got, where you got up to? I got up. Casi cuatro camino. That at, like, yeah, cause yeah. it's literally one, it's like one, uh, a one it's like road. A, it's a one, it's a, it's a straight road. It's a straight yeah, road. And then it's miles. You have to go miles to find another one that you goes like this. It. Like miles. Yeah. He almost got to yeah, the Yeah, yeah. So, so, so it's, like, it's a, it's a <laughs> crossroad. It's a crossroad, right? We call it, we call it Cuatro Camino because it's like four routes. Uh -huh. Like the four routes, that's what we call it, okay. right? And when I got on, yo, she just said, we out. We, got it, we out. And then I'm like, literally, and the thing is like, I'm passing the house, like where my mom is at. Or where my aunt's at, where my dad's at, um, and then there's like two other houses that are on the road and they can see. And when they see me coming, they're like, "Yo, why is this nigga coming so fast? Why are you going so like, fast? Like, why are you coming so fast? Like, you no. know, like you know, the kids cross here, and I, and then they see that I'm really trying to stop it. And then and she you see everybody just going. grab their head like, "Oh my god, what?" The and fuck? then the other kids are like, "Cause they have horses already. The niggas that are road, they get on they horses. And they're then, like, nah, we gotta chase this nigga. And so, they're like, back of the back of the back of the back. Like so, the niggas is going. So and now I'm like, oh, these niggas is going." So just imagine, just imagine, it's me, it's me on a horse, wild. He's on the but, wild horse, and the other two niggas. And then, are, and then once they see me pass, they just automatically were like, "I right, cool, know what like, we're doing." Like, they wow. grabbed on the horses they already had there, and then they booked no. after me. I think, I think Negro had Gabobano. Yeah, Negro had Gabobano. And then, and and I think John Samuel El Blanco. What's your name? El 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 Riquillo. No, 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 no. Fuck, I, I for forgot that. I fell off that one too. Yeah, oh. that nigga busted your ass. Yeah, that nigga, no, busted. that nigga busted his ass. Nah, that nigga busted my ass. That's when I was learning. That's when I was learning how to ride a horse. He busted my ass. So these niggas is going. Booked up, booked up, booked up. And I'm like, oh shit, this shit lit. Again, I'm I'm a little ass kid. This nigga 13, I'm like, what, 11? I'm like, I'm not getting on no horses. I'm not doing this. Uh, not, yeah, not I, yo, I love yo, I love horses. We're bro. not rocking. Like, I get on horses now. Nah, I don't give a fuck. Like, obviously, yeah. after like a year, I got on yeah. horses and shit. I used to get on donkeys like nothing. I'm like, donkeys are small. Yeah, donkeys, right? Like, no, because yeah. I was scared. I was scared. I was scared of the horses at the time because horses, yeah, are, they're big. They're nigga. huge. And the thing is, like, well, I'm well, from well, the well, city. Well, 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 I don't think well, 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 I'm going to get out. I don't think I'm going to get out. 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 I'm going to yeah, yeah. Never again. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I mean, about older than me. Nah, nah, I, I, I like I had my horse on like on on cue, like on cue. I'll I'll, I'll I'll go up on two legs, like, two legs. Like, yeah. yeah, but yeah. again, these the niggas are jetting, yeah. and I'm like, nah, I'm not doing none of that. Y'all niggas chasing. Make sure y'all niggas get back safe. <laughs> 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 and, and then luckily, I managed to kind of stop it. Um, but he was. Far. But I was far as shit. I was far as shit. And then when I stopped it, you know, I got off a little bit. Had to like catch my breath yeah, and like, like uh, nah. collect myself a little and bit. Then, I, didn't you switch? Didn't you switch with with Negro? Yeah. Then I switched. I switched. He got he got on the one of the. I got one that was already domesticated, and then one of the kids from you know from the countryside yeah. that knows more about like riding horses and whatnot. Thing, he got on mine. The thing I think the thing with Negro, I think we we spoke about this, is that he had her loose, too loose at the beginning. So once she felt loose and she felt him be on top of her, she just. She felt like she was like like we were just telling her to go. Yeah, and she just dipped. Because <laughs> when 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 the other kid got on, he had her tight from the beginning, right? So once you have her tight, she knows she, she has restraint. Like she, yeah, right? exactly. So she was just walking. She was walking, 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 walking. But that, that shit oh, was shit. lit though. That shit horse, horse riding riding is fun. So the move, Yo, their movement that. is based on the straps. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, well, you move them like this. You, you train them. Like that, you pull them back. You put you them. They call and I don't know how you say it in English, but in Spanish it's called a bozal. Um, there's there's two of them. There's the one that's just strictly rope, and there's the one that's a metal piece. You put a metal piece in their mouth, right? And it's like a like almost like a like a U shape, yeah. right? And that U shape is on their tongues. So when you pull, right, that metal piece, like I guess like like it's uncomfortable. It's so uncomfortable. They, they move, so they for them to head. for them to move comfortable, they move their head. But if they move the head, they move the body to go through the, towards that side. So yeah. that's why you pull the, the, that's you know, the rope. You, that's how you go, and that's how you manage them, right? And then when you pull back, is you know you're asking them to stop. Yeah. And but but and those horseback riding like um shit oh, that we the parades do, the parades you used to have like these big ass horses <laughs> and then they used to step like they had like a little a little a little step to them oh, like yeah, you hit you used to hit like yeah like every like, that shit was, you you been you been to Central Park right you know the cop horses yeah them big, big ass, ass shit like yeah. that but. Beautiful. But the, nothing against Beautiful. the cop horses. Nothing against the cop horses. Nothing against them. No, nothing against them. But they're they're corny. They're, they're corny. corny as shit. But for horse, for horse, horse purposes, not aggressive. Oh, right? no, not, not, not that. Beautiful horses. These there's niggas a, used to well, like yeah, push shit on their legs. Think about it. Think about it. The chairs were like. There's a difference. There's a difference. There's a difference between let's say like a, 
Oh, how can I put this? Uh, there's a difference between... Um, I don't even know. Okay, okay. There's a difference between someone who could play ball and then someone who got handle. Oh. You see what I'm getting at? So like, so when you came to horses, right? There's there's horses that they're horses and they you know they can walk, they can run fast. You know what I mean? But every other horse can do that. But then there was horses that like there's a there's a there's a there's a like a pattern in their stepping that not every horse has. So you'll have a horse that will come and be like, and then you have one that will. It's crazy. Yeah. So like, and these. But those are trainings, though. Those are training. There's horses that are trained to do that, right? They'll go and they'll walk normal, and then you hit them twice, and then they'll hit a certain a certain tempo, like you know what I mean. Okay, got So yeah, it's it's really it's really dope. But nah, but like in DR, like they used to decorate their horses, bro. Oh no, sure. They used to make like. The custom, saddle? Custom make saddles, right? Custom make, like, the facial thing. You know how we said, like, there was thing in the middle? Yeah. And, like, the metal. Here, make, like, the side of the metal have a, will have a design. They'll have a face. Design. They'll have a face cover. It, it was, it, it, it was lit. Like, like they, they'll do braids on the hair. Like, bro, it's, yeah. it was serious. Like, bro. you could cut, like, 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 a, like, they had haircuts, right? So, you, some of them would have long, like, straight, just let loose. Like long, like, like really long, long. Really like long, my little yeah. pony. Like just think about my little pony, bro. <laughs> exactly. I'm dead ass. I'm dead ass. I'm not even so think, joking. Yeah. So think about my like, little pony. Right? Straight hair all the way down. And then right? there's one with the braids. No, there's one that would have a braid, right? That has braids on them. There's one that will have like the spikes, like a like a what's it called, like a mohawk. Mm -hmm. So some some of them will have some mohawk. of them would just be really like cool. straight up cut, like. A low cut, like they will cut everything. Yeah, they, like you, yeah. You know, you know how they have all the, the way down, they have all the, the way long down. hair through the neck, all the way to like up the shoulder, right? Yeah, yeah. And it goes down to fall to that. They'll just cut it all off, like all that thing, and then mm -hmm. it will look so sick, bro. Yeah, smooth, smooth, look so smooth. Sick, yeah. Bro. So everybody then, has a different. Haircut. It depends on like there's some horses like you know when you put a white horse with a, with a red a uh, uh, black horse. Yeah. The color combines for the. So fur. yeah, so then so then you have patterns. There's on. some horses that have beautiful ass patterns. Bro. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah. Like being in the countryside is crazy. It's definitely a lot of fun. You 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 learn a lot. You need to go to DR. That's it. Wait, I get your auto. I get your auto. No, I get your auto. I ain't gonna hold you. Si lo llevamos, el lío. Lo perdimos, sí. Se se atreve y llegó una muchacha. Ya estamos media hora. Estamos una hora y media. Hora y media ya. Um, it, it, it was it was a nice it was a nice episode. We, we started we started with music, you know, just so people can know you guys a little bit. No, don't take it. Muy bien, don't take it. Te mete al medio. No, nunca, never. No, yo no sé. Take it. You said take it in medio. Tú me dijiste que tú venías caliente, so I started spicy. But talking talking about the countryside and and all that shit was pretty fun. Okay, what the fuck is happening out there? Fuck, bro, you're messing up our audio, bro. Like shit, bro. Like what the fuck? Mount needs to go to the countryside. Yo, what the fuck? Gotham City. Wee, 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 wee. Welcome to Newark. Welcome to the city of Newark. Gotham Brick City. city. Pasa todo. Brick City. Uh, teníamos. Oh, teníamos. Bueno, señores y señores, acabamos del podcast. Acabado, llegado el final. No se olviden comentar, no se olviden darle like. No se olviden que nosotros es aquí que vamos a hacer las reacciones y poner los comentarios aquí, aquí, en este video, en los videos. De podcast que vengan. Tenemos aquí a 4 Music. 4 Music, ¿dónde te podemos encontrar? ¿En qué redes? Oye, tus redes. Estoy por todos lados. Estoy en todos lados. Estoy en TikTok. Estoy en Instagram. Sí, pero ¿cuál, ¿cuál es, es cuál el baile? 4 Music 04 en Instagram por todos lados. 4 Music 04. Por todos lados. What are, what are your social medias? What's your, what's handles. your handles? Mel Cisco. Mel Cisco. On everything? Yes, sir. Instagram, Cisco. YouTube, all of it. Yes, sir. Alright. Viene mano picante. Viene fuego. Por ahí. Good thing. Ah. Yeah, hold your light. You ever know what it is? It's a good thing. Yes, the fuego. Oscuro. Peace. Bye. Oscuro. That was, that was an hour and a half, bro. Hablamos algo mierda. Fue puta. Fue puta. Salgo y todo y yo. Yo, hombre, ya me